you guys the absolute last bag that I think that you should pack because no one knows what life is going to be like after you bring a baby into the world. Especially in my case when I already have an amazing little boy in our lives. So what I've done is I have kind of shopped the sales for out of season stuff because I don't know what it's going to be like for these first six months. Maybe I won't think of shopping for our current little one. Maybe I will. Maybe I'll have a lot of time on my hands to online shop. Maybe I won't. So what I've done is I've, or, or maybe he'll hit this crazy growth spurt. Um, so what I've done is I've gone ahead and I've gotten a couple of, so our, we're expecting one, a new one in June. So here's a couple of clothing items that might get us through, um, up until winter, like it'll probably be January when he can wear this in Texas, let's face it. But so cute. I think it was about 10 bucks for a three piece set from Target. So keep your eye out for those things. Um, I got him a couple of pairs of shorts, um, a couple of sets sh with shirts and pants that match. Uh, so you don't have to do any of that matching, even like a cute little Christmas shirt. So these are just things that. Maybe there's nothing like truly spectacular in here, but then maybe there is. Maybe if he has a really amazing day and he's so helpful, I go in there and I know that he's going to love this sweatshirt and I just grab this and I give it to him as a gift. Um, these could also be used as gifts from the baby. I have seen people do that. When you have a little one already, you want them to get in the mood of liking <laughs> the new baby that's on the way. So you get your current little one gifts and tell them that they're from the baby. We've done that. He loved it. He thought it was so exciting. He was like, this baby knows me so well. And he's just four, you know? Um, but anyway, if you just need like, my fourth grade teacher used to call it a bribe bag, you know, <laughs> at the end of the day, if everyone was good, you got a piece of candy out of the bribe bag. This is my bribe bag. Um, but it is also a fallback just in case life as we know it changes and I don't have the time to shop like I used to. So this is just a couple of pieces. He doesn't grow that much that fast, it feels like, but you know, this could be the year for a growth spurt. So we'll just wait and see. But nonetheless, just a couple of things that I can easily just go in the hallway closet and grab out of the bag and as a thank you, or even if for, you know, a holiday um, gift or just a surprise, just amazing, great things to have to choose from. So give yourself a hundred dollar budget and load it to Target and see what you come up with. Most of this stuff is from Target. Um, Dick's Sporting Goods just had the amazing sale. So I got a couple of uh, sweatshirts and things for winter for him. But, um, yeah, make life easy. Get a couple of things so that maybe you don't have to be out looking for them last minute or realizing, oh, my goodness, it's cold weather now and he doesn't have one outfit to wear. So, anyway, just a couple of ideas. This is the last one. So, I hope that you're able to take from uh, either this bag of items that you already have and this could very easily turn into something for your significant other um if valentine's day is a couple of months after you deliver or father's day is a couple of months go ahead grab a couple of things put them in your little secret hiding place that that person doesn't have access to and then you always at least have something accessible so um this bag and then of course you have your diaper bag and your breastfeeding station or your pumping station bag as well as your hospital bag so i hope that you're able to take from this some great information and that'll keep you ready and prepared for what's coming good luck